hi guys so today is like two days later after tom's birthday so So ideally it's June 8th oh. I'm from showering and at least now since my eyebrows have healed I'm in a position to go ahead and try this face I've never tried this one it's cool so guys you know me better than anyone else so guys i've done this face mask i'm just gonna relax and i'm gonna wait i'm thinking of going to ecd but um i'll let you guys know if i'll go if not i'm just gonna be here i'm gonna moisturize my face a lot has been happening and don't mind my dirty shirt but you guys can you see my eyes like fuck it's so painful every time i wake up like my eyes close and that's why like this vlog is so late it's gonna be like i even don't know if i'm gonna be able to upload it on time because i haven't filmed the other video that i wanted to film so <clears throat> I'm really struggling. My eye is so painful. But the skin is popping. Funny thing. Funny thing. Let me tell you guys. In January, always, always, like always, my skin just does so well. I don't know. I don't know if it's the new year glow or something. Excuse me. Like you guys can't even see. Like. It's glowing. And I love it. It is, yeah, so I'm very struggling um, like with my eye thing, so I don't know if I'll be able to really vlog anything for the rest of the week, and I'm so sorry I'm so sorry, but I'm gonna try and do something like get a video up, just a random video yeah, but I'm so sorry but I'm, forgive me guys because my eye my eye can't take it like it's so painful I don't know Hi guys, so it's practically the next day after flossing to you guys my skin yesterday. Tell me why my eye, I'm having such a bad allergy and I wanted to go to town today but I'm feeling so painful that I'm thinking, like I'm second guessing to go to town because I'm just feeling like, <sighs> okay me I'm really, I really go to town, I only go to town because of my nails because I normally do my nails at Alex Nail Tech. But other than that, I don't go to town. I hate town because it's just too chaotic. You have to walk. Like, it's just too much for me. So I hate going to town actually. But now I have to go to town because one, I bought, um, I'm going to put it here. Um, the It's like a jumpsuit I bought from Be Trendy. I also have to buy the, like, clip holder so that i'm able to vlog well um i also need to go see my hairs like is it extras i don't know yeah um but now i'm just second guessing it's it's like nine in the morning but i'm thinking if i do it right now at least the sun won't be up um like so i'm thinking before like the sun comes up like Jay Wakensana, I can make it to town and back home. But my eye, the only problem I had is actually my eye because I feel like the moment I go to town, it means like Wumbi and Machangu, which might cause this infection to continue being like um, too much. But I just need to go before Jay Wake. Yeah. I'll let you guys know if I'll go. Then <laughs> So I've decided to finally go to town. I'm not cutting anything. This is my outfit. Just um, walked out of the house like that because I was just like, if I start showering, I'll feel like I don't want to go to town again. I could have like driven, but again, 
there's nowhere to park in town like i'd have to pay around 300 shillings for me to park and starting your to stress uh, gari. yeah so see you when i'm back home okay i'm feeling hot i'm back it's currently 12. <sighs> so <laughs> I don't understand how people run businesses in Kenya and specifically in Nairobi and this is to some businesses it's just that like when you say you're opening at 11 like be trendy on the page said they're opening at 11 11 is actually a bit late to open your place but you know who cares it's your job so I'm there guys at 11 I call this lady I'm like how far are you she's like actually i'm not even about to reach i'm all the way in your good can you come after an hour which is so disappointing i feel like you can communicate that on your instagram if you're not gonna be open that early or you know if you're not opening so i looked for another page to buy um the even my two leaders that i need the phone holder for my tripod stand that's also what I had gone to buy. I called them, I'm like, the the, the, the the place that you guys have stated your shop is, like in English Empire, okay, the location of your shop that you guys have posted, that, that you kept on your Instagram, is burnt. Ibrahim's mall is burnt. They, like, the mall, it burnt, like, sometime about last week. And it's another kukulam damo. So, where you guys, so I even thought, like, they was coming, they were like, oh, go to all the way to Biba Biba. It's, like in Native House and then opposite the Baba Patrick Center. So I reached there. I'm waiting. He tells me M1. Guys, I go to M1. M1 is like, um, the shop now is M1. I'm like, they're like, no, as we don't sell anything like that. So I'm like, you know what? It's like, I'm the one who wants to make this sale. It's like, I'm the one, I'm the owner of the business. So I leave them and I'm like, you know, you can't direct someone to M1 if you guys know you have multiple M1s. Like, Anyway, so um, he's like, oh, okay, let me send you the number. He doesn't send me the number. So I go, because opposite is Platinum Plaza. So I go there. Um, there, there is where Lenny Venture is. So the guy at Lenny Venture, he doesn't help me. In fact, he seems very, um, like he's attending to so many people at the same time. So he's not giving me the attention I want. And I'm like, at the end of the day, you guys need this. Sale. Of course, I need the product. But just so you know, I really don't have to be going through all this to just get a product. So I'm like... May I just leave? I'm like, okay, sir, thank you. Guys, and then I call this guy, the one for Ring Tech. I'm like, bro, you told me to send me the number. Like, I don't have to remind you this. Anyway, so finally, I'm assisted. I end up buying it. Oof. After this, this one is firm. It's not so heavy. Oh my god. Oh, it's a fit. Yeah, so. Actually, I only bought this thing that cost me 1000 because of this thing. Because this is the only thing I, ha I need. Because I have the tripod stand. I just didn't have this thing. That's so important for you to keep it here. Yeah, so anyways, I think I'll still use this one. Do I have multiple tripod stands? Like this many ones that I don't think I should be purchasing. But because I don't sell any like this, like separate. I just, like, I just have to buy the full one. So I just don't even separate it. Anyway, so I called this woman like at around 12, 11 30, and I'm like, hi, you had seen, and I, I'm like, I'm hoping she picks up because I've now been being back and forth, back and forth with this other gentleman. So I'm like, she doesn't pick up my phone. And then after two my family remarks, that's when she's calling me. I'm just like, anyway, something also exciting I end up buying I, was this Nearly All Men in Lagos are Mad. It's such an exciting book. I started reading it, I started reading it like in the mat, I mean, page 13. Um, yeah, because my goal of the year, we're just gonna get into that sometime later when I feel better. Is 12 books. I'm planning to read 12 books this year. I don't know if I'll make it, but why, like, what are the odds? 12 books is easy, so I'm hoping to read 12 books. I started reading this one, Exceptional. E is for Exceptional, the new science of success. Um, I'm in page 81. It goes all the way to page 200 and what. But this one, I'm thinking I'll... But I want to first finish this one. Yeah, so my my agenda of this year is to read 12 books. 
I don't know if I'll be able to read both of these two down. I'll let you guys know. Yeah. Anyway, so that has been my run through to town and back home. But ABCs in Kenya really need to improve. They really, really need to improve. Like, I'm just like, how do you guys make profit if you guys run your businesses like this, you know? But anyways, um, let me relax and continue reading nearly all men in Lagos are mad. Yeah, I'm excited. Hi guys, long time no see. Um, I've actually healed my eye, which is pretty much exciting. I'm heading to town right now um, for the clothes that we didn't get to pick last week. And then probably... I really want to go over my finances because tell me why on earth I've spent about 15,000 yet I haven't gone anywhere. Okay, I know some of it is to cater maybe Skylar's stuff and Shamas's stuff, but still, you know, like I'm actually quite anxious. I'm just like, where did the money go? Who's the, who's the thief? Am I stealing from my own self? So. Yeah, I'm heading to town and then later on I'm gonna come back home we are gonna do this finance thing together or I wanted to go for a solo day so probably we can go somewhere yeah well you guys I am from town let me put you guys here oops I'm from town today. I don't know if I informed you guys. I went to pick up my jumpsuit that I bought like in December in 2023. So ideally like right now this is a free it's like it's like I've been given a cloth for free. This is how it looks. Um and then I also up buying this new book i know in this blog we've read two books two books i already finished um nearly all men in lagos are mad i finished it within a day it was pretty much interesting so right now i'm just thinking um i don't know if i go to kfc and buy kfc and just sit up on the kfc or i go to I go to Panadi. I'm thinking just to KFC, honestly. It's easy. I don't know. I think I'm going to go to KFC because I'm so hungry. So I need to have a meal, meal. And then, um, yeah, I think I'm just going to go to KFC. Do I really want to go to Panadi? Yeah, let's just go to KFC. You're not going to kill me, but honestly, guys, I didn't. Um, I sat down for a couple of minutes and then I was just like, you know what? I don't really have to go to KFC. I have Glovo, so I ended up buying from Glovo, which was a big, big mistake because Mara, I've paid, but I'm not able to see. They're telling me to start doing a process. I am mad. I'm angry because I'm hungry. Um, they kept for me the burger. I, I took the, I don't know the name of the burger, but I took that burger. It was spicy and that literally ticked not spicy so now my my mouth has been burning as i eat but the good thing is i was watching alia so that really helped that really really helped a lot of fries from kfc are normally like nice so yeah so i just wanna you know because i'm not going i'm sorry <laughs> um i just thought i should fit on this cloth that we ended up purchasing as the bare minimum that I can give you guys as a bare minimum. Yeah. So this is the what I'd worn before. I can adjust the finger button because I'm so full. Um but let me show you guys the cloth how it fits. So guys, this is how it looks. Um from the back everything looks good, but from the front I feel like it's a bit weird. I don't know. The lighting, the lighting on this side looks off, but yeah, this is how it looks. I like here to here, but I don't like the whole belt situation. Let me carry it so that you guys are able to see. But I like the 
how it fits from the back and everything else but here i don't know Tabu, let me ask instagram how it looks i'm a mother thinking it um guys it's technically the next day i'd like i'd like to um thank each one of you for clicking on this video liking it subscribing we are at i think 231 subscribers if not 232 and i'd like to appreciate each one of you for clicking on this video i know it was a pretty boring um vlog per se because i wasn't going anywhere but that's the reality of life like it's not like every day i'm in a restaurant or i'm doing something fun or something of the sort most of the time i might just be at home chilling <laughs> or um watching a blog or um <clears throat> reading a book so that's the reality of life and i wanted to show you guys the actual reality so that someone doesn't think that oh bilha and hunger always out bilha and the last two no i'm always in the house anyways um i'd like to um take a minute and apologize to christine mainly because um, my audibility on the previous video had maybe an issue to go and also on this video i ended up filming a like a, p a bit of it in um slow motion so also that part was like i had to speed it up and the audibility there might be something like a baby you know like ah! so <laughs> um yeah and also because this video is what i do um like the reality the actual reality is i'm always at home i know not so many people will watch not like my other vlogs so i'd like to um give away something i won't mention so that i don't gas people up or i don't meet the expectation however um just let me know how your january has been it's almost by the time you guys are seeing this it's january 19th on a friday which is tomorrow um just let me know how your january has been and also so that i'm able to um contact you kindly put down your instagram so that i'll be able to dm you and i'll be able to give you your prize um yeah so thank you so much for watching definitely see you guys on the next one i'll definitely try and introduce the vlog because i've noticed that i'm not introducing the vlog which is pretty boring like why wouldn't i introduce the vlog so thank you so much for watching i know it's been two weeks my eye had an issue um but now i'm okay I, I think I, I feel like i'm okay i'm just starting to swell again but i hope i'm gonna be okay so thank you so much for watching once again and definitely see you on the next one